Yo, what's going on, ladies and gents? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be talking about something super awesome. What you guys are seeing in the background is just some gameplay of a Warzone dub that I caught last night while we talk about this crazy news that dropped today and why this news is fantastic for anyone that's streaming on YouTube or trying to build a stream here on YouTube. So again, if you didn't see the information that dropped today, Tim the Tapman released uh, his new video that said he is now moving from Twitch over to YouTube for streaming, which is amazing news for anyone that's trying to stream on YouTube or that is already streaming on YouTube. Um, because we've talked about this a lot on my channel before, uh, and I have predicted that YouTube will eventually become the superior streaming service. I know that's kind of a stretch, and a lot of people think I'm crazy for saying that, but when you take a step back and you look at YouTube and you look at Twitch, Twitch is obviously currently the, su the superior streaming service because they only focus on streaming. It's been around for a long time. But the difference is with YouTube, it's, it's a massive hub for all types of content, right? So they're not solely focused on just streaming. You've got videos, you've got stories, you've got documentaries, you've got movies, you've got, you know, all kinds of crazy stuff, obviously now streaming. And this is huge because now that we're getting more and more bigger streamers to switch over to YouTube, it's going to benefit the YouTube streaming community significantly. So as of right now on YouTube, there's not a lot of different services that they offer with streaming. You have memberships, which are which are essentially like subs on Twitch. Um, and that's pretty much it. I think they just added clips recently, which are still really difficult to figure out where those clips are going and how to find them later. But right now, memberships are really the only thing that kind of competes or compares to Twitch subscribers. And I think that with all these bigger streamers that are now moving over to YouTube, like I'm thinking a lot of people are saying Tim moved over, obviously got paid a lot of money to do it. But I'm thinking that Tim probably also and, and some of the other streamers that have moved over too are like, hey, man, like we're going to move over to your platform. We want a lot of the same services that we're getting with Twitch, right? Like gifted memberships. We want make it easier for people to find us streaming on YouTube. You guys know that it's very, very difficult to find streamers on YouTube. Whereas when you get on Twitch, you watch a stream, they end the stream, they can host somebody or it'll just send you to people that are streaming or live currently that are relevant to who you just watched. Whereas on YouTube, it's not like that, man. Like if some, if you got 20,000 people watching your stream, you end your stream, that that's it. Those viewers go nowhere. There's, there's no... Uh, there's no traffic source to get those viewers of someone's stream to find other streamers. So I'm, I think with all of these bigger streamers that are switching over to YouTube, it'll make it way easier for YouTube to start adding these features, right? Because then there's a lot bigger names that are going to be requesting these things. And gifted memberships is something that I've been waiting for for a really long time. Uh, a better algorithm for, for being found as a streamer is something that I'm also looking forward to. I think YouTube's already got a great algorithm with finding quote unquote streams, but also like videos, you know what I mean? Like you pop up in the recommendation section. It doesn't matter if it's a stream. It doesn't matter if it's a video. If it's relevant, it's going to pop up in the suggested. But I want something that's a little bit more pinpointed on streamers, right? So that it's easier to find someone else that's live and not randomly stumble across them. Like I'm sure a lot of you guys that watch me ended up finding me. So by the way, check out this super sick clip. Just wipe this entire team with one of the worst guns. Uh, ground loot. Pretty amazing, right? But anyways, aside from that, uh i'm 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 thrilled i'm like so happy right now because i've been waiting for something like this to happen and i was talking with some of my buddies about this i'm thinking that here very very soon we're going to start seeing a lot more features added to youtube and uh and hopefully see some some crazy things added that will benefit not only my stream and people that are already streamers here on youtube but people that want to become streamers on youtube i've said this for a long time i will continue to say it i think youtube is definitely the better platform to begin streaming on. I think if you're a brand new streamer that doesn't have many viewers or no viewers at all, YouTube is easily the best place to start just because of their recommendation section and their suggested videos. Whereas if you get on Twitch, you're competing with thousands and thousands of people. If you're playing Warzone at least, or Minecraft or GTA that are streaming with zero viewers and it makes it almost impossible to get noticed. Uh, whereas on YouTube, you know, if you got the right tags, you got the right title, you might pop up in the suggested videos tab of, of someone much bigger's uh, video. So, you know, it's very, it's much easier to be found on YouTube. And that's why I always say that, that you guys should definitely shoot for streaming on YouTube uh, if you're brand new. But 
this is huge news man super exciting i kind of wanted to talk about this a little bit and give you guys an idea of the changes that are probably going to be made here on youtube soon we now have dr disrespect we now have courage we have tim the tap man we've got lupo we've got some seriously big names that are here streaming on youtube now um and i'm really stoked to see where this goes and to see how much youtube grows in their streaming department over the next couple of months so uh, we'll, we'll see where it goes, man. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. I know it's going to be a little interesting. Uh, right now, a lot of people don't really look at YouTube for streams. For those of you that watch me, obviously, you come by every night. You hang out. You know that I stream on YouTube, right? But for most people that are into watching streams, the first place that they go is Twitch. And that's something that I'm hoping will eventually change over time where people will look at YouTube as a streaming service, as somewhere to go watch streamers instead of just going to watch a quick youtube video but those are my thoughts on the situation i really want to know what you guys think are you guys excited about this and how do you feel about where you watch streamers right like i'm sure most of you guys are used to watching on twitch i know a lot of the guys that watch me on youtube are like i only watch streams on youtube which to me is kind of strange but i understand but let me know what your thoughts are on this in the, in, in the comments and also what you think is going to happen are you is youtube going to start adding these features we're going to see them soon. I know they've been teasing them for the last couple of months. So I'm hoping that with this huge announcement, that this is kind of that first step and uh, and seeing a lot of changes here on YouTube uh, and with streaming. So, uh, but that's all I wanted to talk about in this video, man. I'm, I'm stoked. I hope you guys are too. Uh, I'll be live later tonight, just like we are every night. Um, I hope you guys have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next video.